Now, I have my own proposal as well. Right. Okay? This is how I propose we, we fix the McKinley School. This is a crisis. This has become a crisis in this community. It is. It really is. So here's what I propose, okay? This is coming from my heart. Okay. It's a big building. Yeah. The McKinley School is going for a large amount of part of the year be turned into a homeless shelter slash soup kitchen. Uh, that's beautiful. Okay. Yeah. But that's not all. It doesn't end there. Through the spring and summer, we are going to reach out to the finest carnival in all this nation, the best carnies that can be found, and on the site of the McKinley School, permanent carnival for spring and summer. Love It'll it. bring happiness to the neighborhood kids. Love It'll it. bring in money from all the surrounding cities. This is great. But that that's not it, though, Ryan. No. I know what you're thinking. What after that, Joel? Yeah, what happens then? Well, uh, <laughs> Papa Joel's got it covered. Dumbass. Because come fall, we're going to turn that building over to my friends, the Wyandotte JCs, and they're going to use that building as their annual haunted house. Now, I know you're thinking, but what are you going to do? Kick out the bums? Yeah. No. Where do they go? The homeless are going to staff the haunted house. Jesus, you've thought of everything. So just like yours, I'm thinking when, when, when. And just think about it, Ryan. You got those carny, carnies mingling with the local folk. Yeah. <laughs> they start to breed with each other. Generations of rat-faced gremlins can keep that carnival running and an income source for the city for generations to come. Wow. Boom. Problem solved. You're welcome, city council. I'm blown away, Joel. I like that. <clears throat> I like that solution Thank you. Thank a lot. You. Whew. Man, that's a real a real boon for the city that we've now put our heads into the mix with them. Now that we're all on the same page, we're working together, yeah. we're going to get things done.